up, bitches? Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today, I will be reacting to the Flash Season 6 official Comic Con trailer that dropped at Comic Con, like literally an hour ago. Um, I'm so, 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 so excited for Season 6 because it's like the first parts, like the cross, like leading up to like the crossover crisis because the if the newspaper date uh, changed to 2019, I think. Yeah, so like the, obviously the cross is happening now, so the, the day changed, and like they don't know yet, but like we know, and like, oh my god, I think the second half is going to be like a new, obviously, is going to be like a new villain or something, so like, oh, very excited. And before I get into my reaction to the trailer, I just want to say that Candace is my absolute queen, you, everyone knows this, if you watch my Flash reactions, you know how much I love Candace and, and Iris West Allen, like you know this, and I will defend her till the day I die, she is iconic, she is an amazing role model for young women of colour who don't see themselves represented as much, and she has pushed that door open for all these other possibilities, and if anybody says shit, I will be on their ass so fast, this is 2019, enough of the racist hate, okay, she's our Iris... And she's amazing, and she's an incredible actress. She's talented, and I will fight everybody until the day I die. Candace, I stand with you. I support you 100%. I stand, okay? Anyway, sorry. Had to say that. Without further ado, let's get into our reaction video for Season 5. Season 6! Okay, let's go. Bye. <laughs> okay. Season 6, let's go. My name is Dr. Ramsey Rosa. Excuse me? And for the last decade, I've spent my life dedicated to a single cause helping others fight the diseases that plague humanity oh yeah yeah and it's all because of them what the hell this is the new doctor man is he the villain for season six is he going to cause shit i feel like he is there are many cancers in this world and they all wear different faces some are doctors that's only. rude some of them seek out the truth regardless of the consequences Iris, honey! My honey! My queen! I'm so happy for her! Mock the very science they worship. We just ran out of time. What do you mean? But the most dangerous ones are those who call themselves heroes. Excuse me, who is this man? They claim to fight for the things that matter in life. For life itself. Okay, okay. Oh! Why is it every time I come to visit... Bitch! Have well, I ever seen that? I don't know, but I'm watching it again because it's Iris. I can't remember if I've seen that. It looks like it looks new to me. Is that not new? Am I dumb? I'm dumb, right? I don't know. Who cares? Let's watch it again. It's for Iris. Hey, I got you. Ah, queen! Why is it every time I come to visit, there's always a crisis? Hey! But yes, same though. A lie. An eternal enemy who must be eliminated forever. Okay. Sure. And that's death itself. Are we under attack? The scientifically impossible probably will happen. What is... Understand that what? Tell me what I can do. Turn around, no right? has to die. Hello. Ever. Who's that? Again. Who's that? Oh, bitch. I could stand this season, to be honest. <laughs> hey. That was an interesting trailer. That was interesting. So, like... I saw the... N Hold on. Blood work. Okay, his name is Bloodwork because he just popped up on my timeline right now. His name is Bloodwork. I haven't... I don't read the comics, so I don't actually know about him, but he looks really cool. And this villain looks interesting, and I could stand. And I think that he might obviously be after the crisis. But, like... Uh, uh, Cisco's girlfriend, what's her name? I forgot. But, like, Cisco's girlfriend coming up and being like, every time I visit, there's always a crisis. It's a literal mood, literally. So, like, he's obviously, they're obviously gonna find out the date of the newspaper has changed, like, pretty early on, I'm pretty sure. Like, they'll find out really early. And, like, the thing is, they haven't actually filmed enough to actually make a proper trailer, you know what I mean? But, like, this is standard for Comic-Con. They always do, like, the sizzle reel, kind of, like, a leading up to, like, a kind of like a an anticipation trailer, then they release the actual trailer, like when they actually filmed the footage of it, you know. But um, oh, like but but the guy blood work, this dude, like that's actually very interesting. Like, I want so he's a doctor. He must be a doctor, right? 
and who who's been is he a meta? Like I don't want to look it up to spoil it for myself, but like he might be. I'm assuming he might be a meta or like I don't know. But apparently, Godspeed is also going to be like a part of, or he's going to be like in the f season six somewhere. But like I don't know. Where, I don't know. Like I'm just. I'm. And I don't, don't want to spoil it for myself. But like holy shit, and Iris is going to get the co oh, more screen time and content we deserve. Also, I want more West Allen moments as well because. When Grant and Candace are on screen together, their chemistry is so incredible that the episode is automatically elevated to a higher level. Like, they are the gold standard. Like, give them more West Allen seeds because the emotion and the intensity that they bring to their relationship is honestly everything. And it is one of the best things about The Flash. So that should really give me more West Allen moments for me personally and for you guys, do you know? But yeah, that trailer was actually really, it was really interesting. It was a big, it was a good tease for season six. Like, it mentioned the crisis, but it was, like, kind of focusing on this new Doctor guy. But, like, who knows what's going to happen. So I'm very, very excited. So that was my reaction. What did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you guys. If there are any more trailers coming out soon, you'll probably see them, either today or tomorrow. But I love you guys. Ciao for now. Bye!